NBC's American Ninja Warrior follows contestants as they compete to become the next American Ninja Champion and win a cash prize of $1 million. Only three contestants have ever earned that honor, but one is now behind bars. Here's why. Drew Dreschel, who first appeared in the show in Season 3, became the second American Ninja Champion in Season 11 of American Ninja Warrior. But by Season 12, NBC cut all ties with the star, and Dreschel's customary return appearance as champion was edited from the show. By that point, Dreschel had been arrested on federal child sex abuse charges. According to the U.S. Attorney's Office for the District of New Jersey, Dreschel sought to have sex with a minor girl and traveled to New Jersey with the intent to engage in illicit sexual conduct with that minor. Dreschel was a mentor on the spin-off American Ninja Warrior Jr., featuring teen and preteen competitors. I look forward to meeting you guys, and I hope you look forward to seeing the content I throw out there. The victim was 14 years old when she met Dreschel at an event also attended by other American Ninja Warrior contestants. According to Deadline, she filed a complaint when she was 19, accusing Dreschel of abusing her for about two years, from age 15 to 17. She had told her mother what happened in 2015, when she was 15 and Dreschel was 26. Her mother confronted Dreschel, who admitted to the sexual contact, but said he did not know how old she was. Dreschel and the victim continued contact after that time. According to court documents, the victim threatened self-harm if her mother informed the authorities before she decided to file a police report herself. The Justice Department claims Dreschel also, quote, enticed and coerced a minor to travel to Connecticut to engage in illicit sexual conduct and engaged in online sexual communications with a minor and induced her to manufacture sexually explicit images of herself and send them to him. At first, Dreschel planned to plead not guilty, but in June 2023, he agreed to plead guilty on two counts, according to court documents. Dreschel waived his right to prosecution by indictment and consented to prosecution by information, which are often the first steps of a plea agreement. As of the making of this video, Dreschel is being held in a federal detention center in Philadelphia. Dreschel could face a prison sentence of 20 years to life for each charge. He could also be fined up to $250,000 for each count. Upon learning of Dreschel's arrest, NBC Universal said in a statement, Moving forward, the American Ninja Warrior brand will sever all ties with Mr. Dreschel, including his appearance on future seasons of the show. Did the Drew Dreschel controversy change anything about how American Ninja Warrior chooses its contestants? Showrunner Anthony Storm told Reality Blurred, We're a little bit more rigorous in the way that we evaluate our athletes. That said, you're talking about an individual, and not someone that is representative of the community. I think it's extremely unfortunate that Drew did use his celebrity in that way. Per the rules of American Ninja Warrior, each season concludes with either a last ninja standing or an overall champion. In the history of the show, only three competitors have been named champion. Vance Walker in Season 15, Dreschel in Season 11, and Isaac Caldero in Season 7. NBC scrubbed Dreschel's Season 11 win entirely from their list of past American Ninja Warrior champions on the network's website. Dreschel had been last ninja standing on two seasons of the show prior to his Season 11 championship and subsequent arrest. At the time of his arrest, Dreschel's attorney tweeted, Mr. Dreschel is presumed innocent of the charges, and that presumption will remain throughout the pendency of his case. It is respectfully requested that you respect the privacy of Mr. Dreschel and his family. Dreschel's sentencing is set for late 2023, according to Reality Blurred. If you or someone you know may be the victim of child abuse, please contact the Child Help National Child Abuse Hotline at 1-800-4-A-CHILD. That's 1-800-422-4453. Or contact their live chat services.